planet Earth, home to a myriad of life forms. All this life is possible thanks to the water bodies which cover almost 70% of the planet. The oceans and seas connect continents and countries. Ships here form a major mode of transport and business even today. The JNPT Mumbai is a perfect example of a major bustling port. The biggest port in India, the JNPT singly handles a phenomenal 44% of the total container traffic in the country. The number of trucks moving, the quantum of containers handled at the JNPT is staggering to say the least. With over 2,400 trucks flying round the clock, the surface of the container berth faces many a challenging demands. Adding to that are the continuous movements of a number of heavy-duty cranes in each shift. All these cause massive vibrations that lead to intense wear and tear and damage of the concrete bed surface of these berths. Repairs done so far with various conventional materials have proved to be ineffective solutions and needed recurring repairs, thus uneconomical. A couple of factors are responsible for this. Ineffectual bonding and high porosity of concrete. Recently, Dimple Chemicals and Services Private Limited, a pioneer company in dam and concrete rehabilitation projects, successfully completed the repairs of a sizable damaged portion of the JNPT container terminal berth. The innovative PICC polyironite ceramic cementitious technology that has stood the test of time since the last 15 years is adapted for these repairs. The PICC methodology for repairs of dams, bridge restorations, rock mass strengthening and more has been successfully implemented in India and also abroad in countries like Yemen, Qatar, Malaysia, Zimbabwe, Kenya, etc. PICC is 100% indigenous technology developed in India by Dimple Chemicals and Services Private Limited. Raw materials in PICC are majorly inorganic and are available in final form on earth. Hence, there is no self-degradation and the life of PICC is equivalent or even more than the life of concrete. Unique properties of PICC have been tested by well-recognized government and private institutions such as CWPRS, ARAI, NTC, NTH and Structwell. Let's take a look at how PICC was implemented at the JNPT terminal berth in detail. Here we see the removal of the delaminated surface and loose materials from top concrete surface by breaker up to the parent slab. Next in progress is the cleaning of the concrete surface using SteriPure 100 to remove algae and fungi. Water jets are put into action. Hot air is used for drying the clean surface. Application of a bond coat Durabond having bond strength of about 25 kilograms per centimeter square aids in bonding old and new surfaces. Here we see the placement of the high strength modified concrete of up to 75 mm thickness on the tacky surface of bond coat. An immediate sprinkling of Nicomix 100 on the entire treated area comprises of the next process. The next step is curing. This needs about 8 to 12 hours. What we see now is the application of the Durabond. PICC mortar is applied up to 25 mm thickness. The way this was done was very smart and effective 
as it did not affect at all the day-to-day -day movements at the birth. Insertion of liquid PU or tar on all sides of the treated area is critical. After all these processes, it's time for curing. No traffic is to be passed over this portion in this period. After this, a rigorous quality inspection has been performed by Dimple Chemicals and Services Private Limited and the JNPT officers. In a week, the curing is complete. Finally, after a week of the curing process, the top coat is applied. The following are the advantages that make PICC the ideal choice. An extremely robust, high strength topping is now ready on the berth to take on any challenges thrown at it by trucks, containers and cranes alike. The ports with their enhanced remodeled berths won't need any further maintenance as PICC has been delivering results that are truly long-lasting.